Are you kidding me? My gut was right that time. Oh my God. Ah! I'm fine, I swear. Hi, I'm Madeleine Petch, and I'm here playing expensive taste test with Cosmo. The rules are easy. They're gonna give me two of one thing, and I have to figure out which one is more expensive. Before we begin, make sure to subscribe to Cosmo because they make amazing videos like this one. I am attracted to the finer things sometimes, but I also love like a good $35 massage down the street. You know what I mean? Oh man, how am I gonna figure this out? This is actually, I was like, I got this when I walked in here, but now I don't think I do. Okay, let's figure out consistencies here. The one on your left is um silky. This one's a little bit stickier, so on that, I'm gonna say it's the one right here, the left one. No! That probably just hurt your ears so bad, I'm so sorry. Wow, really? I mean, like, I doesn't surprise me at all. How could I know the answer to that? So, I'll take the L, that's fine. We've got some lashes here for you. I'm gonna Vanna White them for a second. This is gonna be tough because my natural instinct is to go with obviously the more floofy ones. However, I have a trick up my sleeve and I was told that the lashes are particularly hard because they're not what you would expect. So I'm gonna go opposite of my gut, just naturally, but I'm gonna feel them first. Ooh, these ones just feel more rough. They feel like they already have mascara on them. See, my gut says this one, but I feel like I'm gonna go opposite of my gut because I was wrong last time. Okay, I'm gonna go with these. Are you kidding me? My gut was right that time. Oh ah! I'm fine, I swear. Blush? Lip gloss. Brown is not a blush color usually. Um, lip gloss, let's see. How am I gonna try this one out? Hmm. This one is like very natural smelling. Like it's got like a couple different oils in it. This one's like fruitier. I have literally no idea. I'm not like a lip gloss wearer. Ooh, that one feels strange. That's sticky. Okay, she's a sticky one and she's very matte. Now it's like, do I go with my gut? Do I not go with my gut? I don't know anymore. I'm very like, I don't know. I wanna win. I'm not gonna win. <sighs> the last one of these I watched, the girl got every single one right. I'm gonna go with the stickier one. The pink one. Yes! Yes! Take that. Yes, Cosmo. Gotcha. We've got some water here, and I suspect this will be the most difficult one. Is one like tap water is the idea? Trying to poison me? Okay. Kind of like chlorine, but again, who knows if my gut's right, so now I'm just stressed. I just spit that back on my finger. Okay, I don't know if this is the more expensive one, but the one that I would drink is this one. So I'm hoping that's the expensive one. And it matches my outfit. I'm so scared of putting things on my face. Um, so let's, let's start with smell. One is a strange color. I've smelled you before. What are you? I know you. I know this one. Give me a second, I'm gonna figure it out. That smells like something you should be eating on a hot summer's day, frozen. It smells like a popsicle. And I'm always like, I always feel like the more natural ones are expensive. This popsicle thing is strange, but I'm gonna try one more tactic here. Where do I know you from? Okay. I'm just gonna wait for them to dry now. Well, I'm gonna go with this one's more expensive. I thought I was on a roll. I thought this was a streak. <sighs> this one, the, I should have known the gold. I didn't even look at the gold. What the heck? Here's the 
here is a world I know nothing about, you guys. Air extensions. Um, I don't, how do you even like, are, are these used? They smell like hairspray. <laughs> the wheeze is great. Now this just smells like something you'd get at Spirit Halloween. It's also got like black hairs in it. Is that normal to have mixed color hairs in a, what do you call these? Hair extensions. Right. Now, mmm, though, look at this. One's sew in, right? And one's clip. Am I right? Am I in the right direction? I think, okay, cool. I don't know. Let's do feel. Let's feel it. This is luxurious. Let's feel my hair. Okay, I'm very similar. Hmm. A little straw like. I'm gonna go with the brown ones. Woo! Okay! Yes, okay, great. Yes, having the hair on my body makes it easier to know how it should feel. Now you don't really look like a highlighter, do you? But now that I've got a wet hand, this should work fantastically, let's see. Getting that, that's a good shot, look at that. Ooh, this is actually quite pretty. She is glowing, all right, let's try this one. Oh man, oh, I don't know. They're both pretty great in different ways. So again, whichever one's less expensive, still fantastic. Oh my God, what if I inhale it? It's about anxiety. It smells like oregano. <laughs> Maybe I'm hungry, I'm not sure. And this one smells more like makeup. Um, I'm gonna go... I don't know. I'm gonna go with this one. I shouldn't jinx myself because I still have a couple more, so let's just let's just keep on going and see what happens. I'm sorry, I just ruined your tablecloth. Now this is something I know about. Watch me get it wrong, but coffee. Cold brew to be exact, which is my favorite coffee drink. This one. See, I told you I know about coffee. I would not recommend this one. I do drink Starbucks every day, so. Got two vegan leather bags here. Hmm, you don't have a brand. It's interesting. Well, I need to know your brand. It's certified vegan, which is exciting. Hardware, I think, is a really good tell on whether or not a bag is cheap. Urban Expressions, and some questionable hardware. I know you wanted to zoom in. There it is, okay. And then I've got Van Holzhausen, which sounds hard to get, so that gives me a little tip. And then it's like very luxurious feeling, but I feel like you could be trying to trick me. Watch this one be $10, this one be 600. But I'm gonna go with Van Holzhausen as the expensive one. Yeah, baby, that's how it's done. How many did I get right? Tell me. I did okay. Did I expect myself to do a better job? I think I did. But you know, you keep on, you fall back down, you get back up again, that's what they say. So, that was good. I think Camila Mendes would be incredible at this. So I challenge her to expensive taste test and subscribe to Cosmo to see if she does it.